Is your AeroGuard farm system in need of a little TLC? Well, today I'm going to show you step by step how to drain the water from your Aero Garden farm for optimal health and growth of your plants. I got this Aero Garden farm from my mom at Christmas time, and I got to tell you, I am absolutely in love with this thing. It is big enough and hardy enough to be able to handle lots of different plants, tall ones, short ones, pretty much whatever you want to grow. But there is one downside and that is trying to empty the water tanks, whether it's to refresh the water or to switch out plants. These things hold like a lot of water. <laughs> so the first step that we're going to do is we're going to get out the hose. Now the hose should have came with the Aero Garden Farm when you purchased it. It's just a thin, clear plastic hose and it's what's going to suck that water out. So our first step is we're going to go to the menu and we're going to select more and then we're going to select the drain garden option. And the first thing it's going to tell you here is to turn your pump off. Um, so it wants to make sure that the plug in the center of the um, tray is in before you turn it off because I have made that mistake and pulled it open before it was ready. Um, this is that plug I was mentioning here. Um, that is where the hose is going to go. But if you don't turn your pump out, a bunch of water is going to start spewing out of that thing, I know from experience. So it doesn't click or anything into that um, the plug part, but it does kind of fit in there snug. And then the other side of the hose is going to go into some kind of bucket or into your sink because the water is going to start flowing out right when you hit next here. So on that menu option, it's going to make sure that you have that hose attached to somewhere where the water can drain, and then you're just going to hit the start. If for some reason you need to pause or stop, it does have a stop option. Um, it's more like a pause option. It doesn't stop it completely. It just puts a pause on the water. You can see there that the water is draining uh, just kind of as a trickle. Um, out through that hose and it does take probably about 15 minutes to get all of the water out of the tray. So while we wait, um, I'm going to prepare the water that's going to go back into this um, once all the water has been drained. So I'm refreshing my tank in this particular instance. And so I'm going to put the Aero Garden uh, fertilizer into some uh, water that I have here. This is just tap water, but sometimes I use rain water or distilled water. The directions say to use four cap fills at the first filling of the water and then six every other time that you're going to refill it, which is about every two weeks. I find this to be way too much nitrogen for the plants. So I only do three cap fills each time. I'm also going to be adding some cow mag. I have noticed that my greens and my tomatoes will have blossom end rot or leaf tip burn if I don't add this stuff. So uh, I find it to be very helpful. You can see I only added probably like a teaspoon into that whole water container there, but the whole container is going to take four of those water jugs. So now we put a pause on the pump and then we're going to put the plug back into place so that you don't have water spewing out. Next step is to go back and we're going to hit the next button on the menu. It's going to tell you to remove the hose and to uh, put the insert the plug back in and it's going to tell you to go ahead and finish and then what you'll do is after you finished you're going to refill the entire container with water and in this instance I'm using my water and nutrient mix. I'll have to also add about three more of these half gallon jugs. So I believe it is a full two gallons that the tray takes. Once you have the water all filled up, we're going to just put the little tray there back into place and we're going to go back to our menu option. We're going to tell it that we're finished. Since I did add plant food at this point, I am going to tell it that uh, the plant food has been added and that is all there is to it. You have refreshed your water. Thanks so much for joining me today to learn how to drain the Aero Garden Farm. If you want to see some of my other Aero Garden videos, I'm going to pop them up here and here. Thanks so much, guys. Happy gardening.